what's good guys back here with another swing fc video uh it's gonna be the third one in the series we've got a cup match coming up but before that it's been something i've been thinking about i kind of want to do it just because our keeper is our lowest rated player on the team cheapest keeper in the world for the rating that he is Gianluigi buffon absolute legend Let's see if I can loan him first. No. Okay. I'm going to try and buy him. It's only worth about a mil because he's 43 years old. But let's see what we can do. All right, well, we have a new keeper. We're going to throw him straight into the team. I'll see you later, Don. Put you right there. Now Welch is our backup, and because he's only 21, it gives us time to develop him, which is fine. And that only cost us a little over a mil. Very nice. In a downpour, that could be All the right, game second game of the... the rain has been lashing down. Normal season, we got a cut match. Salinas. Hendry. Hendry's through on goal. Have a shot. And there's one. First goal of today's episode. First goal of the game. Hendry with a nice, tidy finish. I think Blackburn got the assist there. Keeper probably could have saved that, but we will take that every day of the week. Good finish. 1 0. Barbecue man. Sense. Blackburn. Hendry. Hendry wants it. He's going alone. Turn. Cuts. Back to Wall. Wall with the shot. And he scores. What a finish. Finds the bottom corner from long range. Soon. And it's 2 0. Well, I have to say, Up the boys, really Swang FC. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Did he get some knuckle on that? Or was that just blocked? Little bit of knuckle, keeper deflection into the bottom corner, but we will take it. This way go. Full time. Take that. 2 0. On to the next round of the Carabao Cup. Love to see it. Alright, second game of the day. Our second league match of the year. Against 20th place West Brom, newly demoted from the Premier League last season. Nice Mo. This way go. Rayner. Captain likes to get forward. Raspadori couldn't quite get there. Oh, Henry. Smith tries to chip the keeper, and it goes through. Absolute clash from Smith. Great pass. Excellent finish. And a man runs to the crowd. Man of the people. So white, you might as well be a ghost. Keeper probably should have saved that, but that's excellent technique. And the side spin to 
chip it just inside the post. Love that. 1-0. Finley Smith, the ghost himself. Wow. Thunderstrike from uh, from West Brom. And we've conceded. I don't even think I can blame Buffon there. The defenders just let him walk right in and take a shot. Some subs here. Well, this is the home of live football and more live action from the championship coming your way on EA TV. It's West Bromwich Albion facing Sheffield United. Well, some pretty big news coming through from one of the other games. Let's hear it. Oh, moments of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. Already then. Well, wow, Buffon's beaten twice. Three one the current score line here. Well, three times, but twice recently Barkley. and that right. will be all for this game well, a 3-1 defeat, defeat to a team that hadn't won yet but it's okay all right well that's the end of the first day of filming for this episode i'm gonna film again tomorrow morning and then all right guys we're back to day two of this episode uh, we got a championship match against Barnsley, who are also pretty low on the table. Alright, here we go. Play a slightly different formation today. Or 3 4 3 action, just because. A lot of players that are too tired to play today. Some pretty big news coming through from one of the other games. Let's hear about it from Alex Scott. Yes, it was a penalty strike from Ben. Can he put them in front? Oh, fuck off. The emphatic answer. And you have to say it was all the cards. What am I supposed to do to get the ball through? Every time I pass it, it's going to go right to the defender. Promising possession, this. Piss poor from us, to be honest. Alright, need a win today. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And we're on the cusp of bringing you live action from one of the Can they convert? Great way to start. Absolute fantastic passing build up. And Henry makes it one no. Home crowd loves it. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. It's a really good move for everybody. Up a cul de sac in terms of the attack. Blackburn. Promising possession, this. And fine use of the ball. 
Bobby Schumann. Have a shot. Oh! What a finish! Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for Great the turn. Really well, he just has a shot from the corner over there. It just drops Odin over the keeper into the top corner. What a finish. Nothing the keeper can do. Barbecue man's first goal. Take that. Raspadori, and it's three. That should be all. Big win at home. Great finish from Raspadori. Come on as a super sub to sure up the win. Great ball in. I think that was Rayner. Could have been Smith. I think that was Rayner. It was a great pass. Good touch. Good finish. Keeper had no chance. Go, Hendry. Get one more. Oh, he's at the post. Wow. All right, 3-0. It's a good way to end off the episode was with a big win. All right, let's take a quick look at the stats thus far this season. Appearances, Leafs got the most... Followed by Rayner and his Wigo and Hendry and Blackburn. Sleekness. Goals. Hendry has the most with four. Raspadori three in one less match. And Smith with two. Wilson with two. His Wigo one. Wall. Blackburn. Blackburn does have one win. Did he score? Oh, he scored once in the preseason tournament. That makes more sense. Mesquite says one. Nobody else has one yet. Assists. Hendry has the most goals and assists. Wow. Green sheets. Leaf. Surprisingly, Blackburn. All right. Well, that's going to be it for today's episode, guys. Let me know what you want to see, who you think I should sign with the remaining transfer budget. I've had some, call, like, some comments asking about signing players from Ajax. I'm not sure we need more players. The issue... Spots I really want to fill. We definitely need to get another left back and another right back. They don't have to be amazing. They just have to be able to be decent enough that we have some squad depth at those positions. And then we probably can grab one more center mid. Strikers, I think we're good. We have three. And wingers, we've got a ton of them. And center backs, we've got a ton. So center mid and then a left back and a right back, I think we should, should be enough. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.